At first, it appeared the concert goers were less than enthusiastic about the show, but eventually, Joel brought even the normally subdued Soviet crowd to its feet. Later, Billy Joel spoke of his feelings on the Today Show. The show was unbelievable. Uh, it started out a little bit on the quiet side, and I think what happened was there was a change in the audience. Some people left because it was too loud, and we do have a loud show, and their tickets were taken by kids outside who just came in and everything started changing around. Uh, by the end of the show, I tell you, the crowd looked like it could have been Detroit, it could have been Philadelphia. Uh, it was the same thing. Joel said he will drop a couple of ballads from the two-hour-plus show, claiming they, as he put it, just kind of laid there. Billy Joel will barely break even on the $2 million production, but organizers say any deficit will be recouped. An electric piano smashed a microphone on stage. Joel got ticked off when his American film crew turned spotlights on the crowd to capture their reaction to his performance. Joel is making a documentary while he's there, hoping to get back most of the $2 million it's costing to do the tour. When interviewed, Joel passed off the onstage incident as just part of the show. I didn't throw a, t throw a tantrum, I threw a piano. Red. At one point, Joel took uh, some of his frustration out on the audience. Annoyed when he uh, wasn't getting any response from the first few rows, he told them to leave if they didn't like it. But most of the audience enjoyed the show. After what the musician said was a slow start, the reserved Soviet crowd transformed into a clapping, enthusiastic audience, more like uh, Joel's American fans. In the Soviet Union, all, all the people, like uh, Billy Joel, it's a pity that he stay only three days here. Joel has one more performance tomorrow night before moving on to Leningrad for three other concerts. Tomorrow night he sets his hair on fire. <laughs> we could look forward to putting to that. Thanks for being with us.